you cool cats, this is me and welcome back to another episode of Donga Ropa Ultra Despair Girls. Uh, in this episode, hopefully I will find that sparkly that I missed in the past, uh, that was told to me by the same people as before, so hopefully we'll find it. Um, alright, cutscene time. He said there's a subway entrance at the blue building in the business district, right? Yeah, we need to get there for now. What? What do you want? <laughs> Another challenge? I challenge you to a treasure hunt. You look like a dummy, so I'll be nice and give you a hint. The treasure box is drawn on the map. There are three letters written on the treasure box. X, T, and L. The odd box with the letter that looks like L but has an X is the real one. That's it. End of hint. QED. I wish you the best of luck. Alright. Looks like an L, but has an X. <laughs> you can't seriously be thinking. Weren't we going to the subway station? Well, either way, do whatever you want. So, I don't know if it's because I've been, like, recording a lot, or... Oh, I just saw a Monokuma. <laughs> I don't know if it's because I've been, um, recording a lot or, or something, but... Man, my eyes are, like... I'm fed up with going to the subway. Didn't we already go there before? We should be going for something more like... A woman's ultimate happiness. You could think about your marriage to Biakia later. I'm supposed to like. Can I just electrocute them all? That worked. There's a Monokuma that fled somewhere this way. Got rid of that one. Okay. Okay, this one has an L. Could it be that the letters have something to do with the paths drawn here? You look really pumped for this. What? I'm a little confused. The challenge was something like... Looks like an L, but has an X. Oh, right. I need to also find that sparkly. I keep getting distracted. Alright. So yeah, my eye is hurting so bad today. It's been hurting like a little bit each day of the week, but it's really hurting pretty bad today. So I think I might only record one episode. It's that arcade machine again. So I don't know how much I can record and edit without being absolutely miserable. I guess to make up for it, I'll try to upload the a bunch of- The shield ones are everywhere. It'd be a shame to miss defeating some. Okay, so I have to be careful which ones I activate here. Is, are they all standing? Okay, hopefully they- they are. Get him. Hmm. Another game corner here. The shield ones are everywhere. 
Oh, be ashamed he's to already the standing song. on the elect on the water. So I did not I did not need to activate that one. Oh my gosh, this <laughs> might cost me. I failed twice. I hope that doesn't. Maybe if I don't mess up at any more points, I'll be fine. Ugh. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna blame that on my eyes hurting so bad. Anyways, as I said, I'm only gonna probably record one episode. Um, the reason why mobile games don't bother me so much is because I don't have to edit and I don't have to stare at the screen for hours. So I just have to play them and then straight up upload them. This seems suspicious. How many of these are traps? Hmm. Is there a way to tell? No. Super studying technique. Oh my gosh, it's expensive, but... I'm guessing when I click on this green one, I'm gonna get attacked. What the hell is you? Anyways, I, I still don't get that message. Like, an L, but shaped like an X. That one's an X. I'm guessing it means, like, one of these pathways is shaped like an L. Oh, there's gonna be Monokumas up ahead. Burn. Is that a new kind of bullet? This looks pretty useful. Yeah, you're right. It's not too late for a tutorial. It appears that you have obtained Burn. Burn is the truth bullet that, you know, burns off Monokuma's generator device. It has a high rate of fire, so it's perfect for shooting at enemies who move swiftly. It's downright awesome against those beast Monokumas. I think it would be also be really good against enemies who are running straight at you. Go try it out. I'm guessing there's gonna be a Monokuma that's gonna... Here we go. Terminator Monokuma. The Monokuma is flying? Okay, we're getting pretty far from the whole bear concept Combat here. veteran. Did I zone on accident again? I did! I'm so sorry. I have a tendency to back up when I'm firing. it left T. That's not right. There it is. Gross Butlerix. Real name Alosius Pennyworth. An annoying old demon that was the butler for the Togami family. It has the super creepy voice that always goes Welcome home, young master. Also, it has a weird special ability that makes its attack power go up when the young master Togami Miyakiya gets made fun of. So make sure you're extra careful. 
I wondered who Togami was going to have as his uh, important person. Makes sense that somebody that serves under him would be the uh, an X that looks like an L, or an L that looks like an X. I don't like these uh, narrow hallways. Small Japanese style bars. Can you drink alcohol, Toko? Or are you underage? Jeez, no need to bring up such a touchy subject. Touchy subject? Is this like some sort of like. some sort of joke that I don't understand? Like maybe her age changed around or something between some of the games? Where am I going? What does this map say? That leads up there. Let's go this way, I guess. child or whatever. Wow, you really burn through these bullets pretty fast. Oh, Sparkle! The war between Despair and Toa is near. It has been rumored that a full-on war between the Ultimate Despairs and Toa Group is drawing near. Ever since the incident, Toa Group has been doing everything it can to counteract the Despair. So lingers the ocean. The love that is far too pure for the main character, me, and the fisherman, you. Indubitably foray into the inner peace at the skillful stroke of a pen. Popular female author Toko- <gasps> Toko Fukawa's most renowned work, the long-awaited unabridged version! Ah, uh, this is... What? Oh, that's right. It's my novel. Got a problem with that. Amazing! Oh, not at all! I'm really impressed! I've read this! It was so sad and really good, too! I can't believe it! So you are the writer of So Lingers! Don't mess with me! So Lingers? You're abbreviating the title of the book I wrote to my face? And of course it's really good! Who do you think wrote it? <laughs> As expected of the ultimate writing prodigy, you sure have confidence. But... But I mean... If you can write a beautiful romance like this, you can definitely marry Byakuya. Are you an idiot? Don't be an idiot. What's written in there is pure fantasy. There's no way I can act like that in reality. Oh, uh, really? Hmm. What I wrote in my novels is my ideal of an ideal world. Because I know it will never be reality, I have to write it in fiction. Hmm? So you write it because you can't have it, but doesn't... But don't most writers write from experience? Nothing. Not necessarily. My theory is that only happy people can... My theory is that only happy people can only write happy, shallow novels. But the downtrodden can vividly imagine their ideal world, perfectly envisioning true beauty. That's the spirit I put in my novels. Hmm. Well, I kind of get that, but I kind of don't. Well, uh, based on my theory, I wonder if I can keep writing interesting novels. Hmm? What do you mean? Like I said... Well, like I said, I'm concerned. If I have a friend like you and I'm happy... Could it be? So you mean making friends with me made you a little happier? What? Don't mess no, with me! No, there's no way a crybaby schoolgirl like you could actually interfere with my writing. You underestimate the intensity of my novels. Said it yourself. 
<laughs> well, if you're that confident, I'm sure you'll be just fine. That was cute. This arcade machine is everywhere, isn't it? Okay, what is this? I gotta get it right on my first try. I can't have any I need them space. all to blow. Destroy them all with one explosion. Tell me that works. Oh no, it's because I got caught. Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna have to hope that it works. Metafujurus Fujiko Yamada, a manga artist demon who made Tara Spa. Before you kill it, make it write a lot of manga and put you in a comic book. And if it complains, choke it to make it do what you want. It likes to draw naked pictures of boy demons, so give it plenty of bodies to draw. <sighs> Yamada, your sibling is mess. one shaped like an L? I don't think that's an L. Could it be? I wonder if those kids were also treated curly by their parents. Hmm. Even if they were, would it matter? Even if their parents were murdered, it doesn't give them the right to kill people. You're right. No matter the reason, it's just... It's unforgivable. It's far too suspicious. And not just that, it's peculiar. I doubt the ring... I don't doubt the ringleaders had terrible childhoods, but I can't think of any reason for all these other kids to suddenly be motivated to kill. Mm -hmm. So, why are the other children going along with this? You're right. I have a bad feeling about this. It's gotta be these helmets. I haven't seen a sparkling um, Monokuma child in a long while. I'm doing poorly. It's that arcade machine again. At these arcade Let's machines. get a move on. If they bunch up near the car, we can defeat them all in one go. Definitely, I've definitely messed this up already. thinking this one through properly and I messed it up. Well, this one's shaped like an owl. Oh, is this one the right one? Sad face! Huh. I believe I can handle this riddle myself. Well, good, because I wasn't planning on helping anyway. Battle skill. Come 
Tomorrow can run even when the hacking gun is readied? That was worth that. Completely. I feel bad guys. I probably missed sparkles and I just I'm not that attentive today. I, I can only blame it on um, my eyes hurting so bad that it's just really stingy and it's really hard to focus on the screen. So I'm gonna make this episode work, but come on man. I'm really hoping that by some miracle I picked up every sparkle. I have not seen any Ah, signs. Kids. Reliable as always. Looks like the subway is that way. Like, seriously, I'm pretty sure I did not collect all the sparkling hidden children. And my eyes hurt too bad to look. Come on, man. I have a feeling when we go down to the subway, we're just... That's gonna be the end. supposed to lure it into this pool of water. That was stupid of me. seen any hidden children. Uh... There's an arcade machine over there. <laughs> the Monokuma kid has to be hiding here somewhere. Listen for the singing to find the brat. This is the way out. need a moment to memorize what's going on here. Okay, it's, it's on the other side. I have to wait till this one moves. be all for this episode. I'm really sorry that I didn't get any more episodes of Dunga Rumble Ultra Despair Girls recorded, but I will try to make up for it next week with multiple episodes. I'll try to aim for three. Or who knows? Maybe I'll, maybe I'll finish it. <laughs> I actually don't know how much longer this game is. But 
that'll be all for this episode. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.